everyone, Yanjo here, and I've got another package to unbox, another figure. Um, before I get started, I just want to say, I have still yet to receive my uh, Makoto Misaka sister's Beach Queen figure. I have no clue where it is. I've contacted the seller. They haven't gotten back to me yet, so I'm going to send another email uh, to make sure that they get it and make sure that they get back to me. Because I'm starting to get worried that I've wasted 50 bucks and a on a figure that I'll never get and a figure that I actually want. So, uh, this I'm going to be opening up. It's, I got to use quite a big box, actually. I got this is the Ryuko Matoi Fat figure, F, or no, P H A T. It's a company, I believe. Um, I got this on eBay for 104 bucks. I think normally normal price for this was seven, 75 bucks, and then they kind of went out of stock due to people wanting them so badly. So then they came harder and harder to find, and now you can't find these for less than a hundred bucks. So the one I got was the most, or was the cheapest that I could find with free shipping. Uh, and Amazon didn't really have any and uh, whatnot, so. so I just ended up buying it from eBay. I still hope my address didn't get shown, because that would be bad. Might have to blur that out if it's actually visible. Yeah. Actually, it was a girl that sent, that owned it. Never mind, not a guy. Okay. So, came in the original box. Nice. Uh, this is the first used item I think I've bought. Well, actually, no. Yeah, actually, this is. So... I'll have to go over the box. box actually looks nice. Looks like she took care of it. Or really good care of it. Um, okay. So. On the top. Okay, so FAT stands for Pretty Hot and Tempting. P-H-A-T. So on the top you have Senkets. His uh, eye and his eye patch. And then on the front you have like his little jaw, or like his mouth area, because it's got the teeth on the front and bottom, and also that's the figure inside. This side has got another window in to see in. And then on the side you have uh, Kill la Kill, uh, Ryuko, Matoi, and Senkets version. Is that what it says? Kamui Senkets version. Bottom has nothing on it, and this is the back just to show the two different styles of the figure that you can do. It's a one-eighth scale figure. Okay, let's open it up. Okay, looks like that was packaging. Yep, included all like the bags and stuff with two. Instruction manual card. Includes what's all included. We got just to make sure we got the hand, an extra hand, got it. Uh, we have two base pieces which are there. Got Sure. Uh, two scissor blades. Got that. A uh, little peg piece. Got that. No. I'm not sure. Ooh, it looks like it might be missing. Oh, no, there it is. Okay. I was going to say it looked like. She had missed one of the scissor blade pieces, but it was just hiding with the other scissor blade. Uh, it was missing this piece, but it was under, 
I couldn't find it, it was just underneath. That is the grip, right? No? Where's the grip elsewhere? Not really sure, I'm gonna have to look through this. Up oh, there's the other grip piece, okay. I'm like trying to look around because she didn't put anything there. That's the scissor one scissor blade, the decapitation mode, that's actually pretty big. The normal scissor blade, also fairly big. And comes off uh, the base. like you can have two different things on it like this comes off and whatnot and then the figure herself which is in a pose that you can change to either I'm guessing yeah the hand comes off either one of the deca the decapitation mode or the normal yeah so I guess that's it for this figure unboxing. Uh, don't have much to go over other than what I've already gone over. Uh, so yeah, this figure, uh, this review or unboxing should come out the same day as my Satsuki Kiryuin Figma review. I, this is going to come out first and the one other uh, one later today. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to wait and check out that Satsuki Figma review and uh, the review of this and my Mizure Shiryuki uh, Shusui, or that figure next week and the week after that. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys. Oh, and don't forget to check out uh, my new gameplay stuff. I've decided to do a new schedule, Hour of Power every day of the week, uh, Sunday through Saturday. I've got seven different games going on, one video each day, hour an hour long video each day of a different game. So yeah, uh, check that out. I've got Skyrim up already, uh, Metro is going up today as of filming, and then tomorrow I forgot what's going up, and then it's Wednesday. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.